In this video, I'm going to show you how to find the distance between two points, and we're going to do it with Desmos. So in line one, you're going to enter the distance formula. D equals the square root, or you can come down here to the keyboard and hit the square root button at the bottom. Parentheses, X, I'm, I'm going to hit two, and you'll see it creates a subscript. So I'm taking the X coordinate of my second order pair, minus x sub 1, that's the first x value of my uh, two order pairs, okay? So from the first order pair, the other x value, squared. And to hit squared, I hit shift 6 on my keyboard, or you can use this squared button, this a squared button. I'm moving my arrow to the right to come back down out of the exponent, plus, and I'm going to repeat y sub 2 minus y sub 1. And again, I'm not doing anything special to create those subscripts. I'm just hitting the number 1 or 2, and Desmos knows to create that subscript. And again, squaring that term. All right, so here is the distance formula. I'm going to add a slider for all of these variables. Now notice that the order that they appear in right here is the order that you will see when they drop down. So the second x value, the first x value, the second y value, and the first y value. I'm using the two ordered pairs, negative seven, six, and negative five, negative one. And you don't have to type them here, that's just for uh, my reference. So my second x value, Here's my second order pair. This is the x value. So it's negative 5. My first x value is right here, negative 7. My second y value is negative 1. And my first y value is 6. So I'm replacing those variables with the values that correspond to the ordered pairs um, that I was given. All right, well, you see that once I have a value for all of these, the distance formula calculates for me. And in this case, it looks to be about 7.28 or 7 and 28 hundredths. The other option, which may or may not be available to you, depending on which version of Desmos you're using, in this Desmos demo, I'm using the full version. There is a built-in function called distance. So when I type in letters, they come out italicized. However, when I type in a function, you'll notice that when I hit that E right there, this um, format, the font, changes to a regular font, and that's how I know I'm using a built-in function. So if I want to find the distance between two points, I can simply enter those two ordered pairs. There's one, comma, and then the other one. Okay, so I've entered my two order pairs separated by a comma, and I get the same value as before, seven and 28 hundredths. One final way is if I labeled my two ordered pairs, so I'm gonna call this one A, and I'm gonna call this one B. If I wanna find the distance between A and B, I just type them in just like that, um, and you'll see that I get the same result. Here's point A, it's blue, and here's point B, it's green. So the distance between these two points is seven and 28 hundredths. I hope you enjoyed learning how to find the distance between two points using Desmos.